Okay, we've just arrived at Fairmont Farmer's Market down in Center City, Philadelphia near the Art Museum. And it is just a tad hot, like 93 degrees or something. It's pretty hot. Setting up. And we're right next to the Eastern State Penitentiary. This is where Al Capone was in prison for a while. Pretty cool tour if you take it around there. Okay, hon, I'm gonna take a walk around. I think everything looks great. What's that? Oh, well, she didn't like that. No, I didn't like it. So what's really cool yeah. is that we moved away from here. We moved away from here like 20 years ago. And now we're back here 20 years later, the farmer's market selling organic vegetables. So this is the Fairmont section of Philadelphia or the art museum area. And there's the Philadelphian. And since we left, it's gotten a little bit nicer. We made a nice parking lot here. They also have these really cool bikes called Indigo. Which allow you to take a bike into the city. It's kind of cool. This was like our favorite place to come all the time for dinner every night when we lived here because we lived right up one block behind it in a little street called Pig's Alley. That's where we lived. So this little street over here Believe it or not, it's one of the oldest streets. And it's a locked street. You can't get in unless you live there. That is where I lived. And that is Pig's Alley. My house was the second house on the right. It was definitely cool living down here. But when we decided to have kids, we decided not to have them go to public schools in the city, so we moved out to the country. One of the best things about this neighborhood is they had, oh, probably eight or ten really fantastic restaurants to eat at. So you could go out and within a two block radius, there were like eight restaurants you could eat at. Rembrandt's, London Grill, Amano, Jack's Firehouse. Um, Tavern on the Green, not the one in New York. This is the one in Philadelphia. Here's a better picture of the Eastern State Penitentiary. Pretty massive complex. Takes up pretty much four city blocks here. And my favorite restaurant. I took my son Calvary when he was young. Boy, and he never forgot it. He loved this place. Jack's Firehouse. Fantastic food. Great service. They don't have the tables out yet. It's too early. But this place, don't miss it if you come into Philadelphia. It is awesome. So now they have these tours. When I lived here, they never had the tours. Now they have tours of the Eastern State Penitentiary with headsets like at Alcatraz. They can just walk around. There it is, fourteen dollars. All right, so maybe we'll come back and do a tour. Place is gigantic. It's 
So I think I decided not to take the tour today since it's like 93 degrees, it's sweltering hot. It's not gonna be any cooler in there, though it may be. Okay, there was just an accident. This guy like ran into the back of a parked car. The lady had her flashers on. And the guy like drove into the back of her. Huh? Like she's parked. And the guy just like slammed into her. So they're still going at it over there, fighting away. We got to get back to the market. Okay, so the police finally got here, and all order has been restored. So I just realized we were down at the art museum, you know, doing this farmer's market today. And since I didn't do this Eastern State Penitentiary, what I thought I'd do is come over to the art museum and you know, run the steps of the art museum, like all the tourists do, and look at the Rocky statue. So that's what I'm going to do. You can see him up there. Ah, there he is, there he goes. No more of that. I think I'm just gonna walk him instead. And then run towards the top. All right, we'll run a few. It's not that far, really. It's not like a big thing. You gotta go 10 more times. So now it's just a beautiful spot to come. Everyone takes pictures of the city, skyline, fountain. And the art museum. I never really realized there were that many people that came here to the art museum just to take pictures and running up the stairs. But I guess it's an iconic landmark in the city and people will come and they do push-ups too. This is so cool because this is a spot I remember. Blizzard of 96 here in Philadelphia. We're behind the art museum here and these rocks right here, these big boulders, the snow is about six foot deep here and we are snowboarding jumping off that top and landing down here. It's so cool. Blizzard of 96. Awesome. Snowstorm in Philadelphia. We're right in the back of the art museum. Never forget that. Had a skate and snowboard shop in the city in 96. We did it right here. 